So today we're going to be highlighting a different open source free firmware that uh, can be run on the Belkin router that I have here. This is a uh, Belkin Share uh, F7D 3302. Uh, it'll also run on the 3301 Share Max as well as the Play and Play HD that uh, we've done stuff with in other videos too. Uh, along with a plethora of other routers. It's very similar to DDWRT in some ways and very different in others. Um, flashing it is uh, just as simple. Uh, we'll grab the firmware from tomato.groove.pl. This is Tomato by Shibby. So at his site, hover download, click Tomato Firmware. Then for this router we want the K26. So go there and then build 5x128EN is currently the newest. Now, uh, depending on when you're watching this video, there may be a newer one. So just look over here and see what the latest date is and uh, browse into that build folder. Now, once you're in here, you're going to want the one with the um, model number of your router. So this one right here is the F70-3302. We're going to go ahead and save that but uh, navigate over to your uh, router setup page. Now you're going to go to the firmware update option, um, leave the password blank to begin with, and uh, then uh, choose file, and you're going to want the one, the trailed build, which has your uh, router's um, model number in it. Click open, click update, click OK, click OK. Now you see it upload down here in the corner. Now it's waiting. Okay, so now uh, that it's uh, finished updating, it may go to a, a failure page uh, here quick that uh, says uh, unable to access, but uh, what? You may have to hit refresh, basically. Um, it'll ask you for authentication. So the default password is admin. The username is admin. And the default password is admin. Then once you get logged in, um, you'll notice, here it is. It's a very nice, a very pretty looking um, UI. So now that you've got it loaded, uh, you'll be able to watch some of our upcoming videos on uh, what you can do with this. So that's all for now. Thanks for watching.